All right, good morning. We're going to be doing a fill piece IR refrigerant leak detector DR82 reviews. How easy and quick it is to find a leak on this multi head system. Okay, so we normally run this on all connection, and then if there's a bubble, we will. No, when this one detects it, then we spray bubble just to confirm. But a lot of times, 100% mostly, when this thing goes off, like this thing goes off, there is 100% leak in that area. Okay, so we're going to show you how to find it. Um, I already checked on all those connections right there and right there and all of this here. And there's no leak, okay? I checked through all of this and normally it would beep here and it would also make this one 200 or 99 99 from 0 to 99 and I did not see anything here okay so we're gonna go up in that highest one we're gonna go up to there and then check for that one okay all right let me just post this so I can climb up okay I'm climbing up right now so there is this is our last connection here up here so what we're gonna do right there that's the connection okay and then we put this nozzle look look at the nozzle it's not beeping anything so as soon as we put it in here starts making that thing right so that's where the leak is over here also See, see that it go crazy so a lot of times the reason for that is there's no adapter like the like the ring the copper between this thing and this thing so you cannot just have a brass to brass you gotta have a copper in between that will be your seal on okay so this is our our leaks right here and then we can also double check with a spray bubble okay let me just get the spray bubble. So now we found the, the leak from here. We're going to spray it and double check. Sometimes like a very small leak, you can't see it by the bubble. But, you know, with that leak detector, you can easily see it. So with the spray bubble, you can't really tell if there's a leak or not, but... See, you don't even know that there's a leak there. It's a very small leak, which you would never see it when you just spray it. But with the leak detector, it shows that there was a leak. Okay, so, so that's why you can't just trust with the micro bubble because sometimes very small leak will not be seen by the eye. But with the leak detector, you can see it. Okay, that's how you do a leak detection. And then, now see it bubbles up very tiny. So the leak right here, if you look at that. Very tiny leak, which you will not see it directly with your eyes. All right, guys, I'm gonna go down before I fall. Here's right here. Also, this is how you know that there's a leak in the system. Your pressure goes low and uh, the high side in the heat pump becomes a low side and it's icing up. That's how you know that you have a leak in there, okay? So, that's it. And then, buy this thing here. It's 100% recommended by me. Please subscribe and share about this product. They're really, really good. Okay? Thanks, guys. This is TJ SVAC. Bye-bye. You never know. Okay, it's up and running. We got it all fixed. Thank you guys for watching.